Time for a final look at some of the historical secrets that are being opened up across the Midlands as part of the Heritage Open Days Festival. Tonight we're in Leicester and we visit the oldest of the three buildings we've shown you. Yes, the city's magazine gateway was built in the early 1400s, but it's rarely open to the public. And if you've ever wondered exactly what it was, this weekend is your chance to find out. Callum Watkinson reports. Dominating the historic heart of Leicester, the magazine gateway has had many names and many uses in its 600 year history. This was built around about 1410 and it's part of medieval works of religious precinct and this would be the symbolic um, entrance. Later on, um, after the Protestant uh, Reformation, it came into secular hands. It got its current name in the 1600s. It was used to store gunpowder and at some stage, prisoners of conscience during the great battle for England's soul that accompanied the rise of Protestantism. On the top floor, on the lintel, there's some graffiti in Latin. Now this is evidence that this was possibly used as a prison. In fact, it's in Latin means it's not a prison just for an ordinary criminal. It's somebody who's very well educated. And it says, John Loudham, hereby other men's trespass and not his own. But in its early days, it housed important guests and came complete with all the mod cons the Middle Ages had to offer. The many of the estate agents would probably point out the conveniences. So we have two garderobes, which are medieval toilets, which basically is a hole in the floor. That's still more sophisticated than using the river saw. Uh, the one above the other, so you did have to get your, your timing right. Later used by the Leicestershire Regiment as a barracks and museum, a bell they pinched from a temple in Burma still hangs on the second floor. The building's been besieged many times by troops during the Civil War in the 17th century and by workmen in the 20th when the Newark underpass drove a dual carriageway beside its very foundations. The tunnel was filled in six years ago, recapturing for the precinct round the gateway something of its medieval serenity. Then religious students would have gathered here on their way to and from the churches in the Newark. Those who run this city in the present are proud of its two millennia of past. The Heritage Open Day is a wonderful opportunity for Leicester to show off its unique 2,000 years of history. We have this year over 30 buildings opening in the city. That's more than ever before. It gets bigger and better and it's an opportunity for us to show off those buildings and to remind people of the remarkable history of this city. It's the type of thing that people drive past or walk past every every day on the way to town or perhaps a way to the university and you probably wonder what, what it is and this is a good opportunity to find out what it is and what it was.